Okay, thank you very much. On to um, a bit more of a downer question, but at first it was the karaoke bars that had issues. Now it seems like it's bingo halls. Is there, you, you, Mr. Dubé, you said it very clearly before, but up until now, has there been a, a breakdown in that messaging, that communication that people are not understanding? Uh, well, I'll take that. Um, I think people sometimes are very good, and I saw a couple of articles on that subject, but I'll, I'll say it very quickly, are very good at finding the little hole in the law, in the principle, in the directives. And I think that what we should tell those people that can find the little thing that they could be technically allowed to do to use um, their creativity in protecting the people that they have asked to come to a bingo. And that's the only thing I'll say today. Um, when you see this situation at Boisbriand, the bingo, um, how do you feel? Do you feel tired or discouraged that the message is not going through? Right. No, I'm not. Uh, person that is uh, that you can discourage lightly uh, easily um, I'm annoyed sometimes because uh, as for the bingo uh, um, as I mentioned I think that uh, I'm I'm even surprised that people don't realize those organizer even though they found the uh, for, for, for for now the way to say that they understood that they could do it this is not the matter of saying that you could or not do it. Should you do it? Should you invite uh, people, age people, in a room that uh, will, they will yell and say they're happy that they, they won? I, I think that's a lack of judgment. I'm sorry, that's a lack of judgment. So that's a bit annoying. I'm being very transparent, and I think that uh, when, and that's the reason I'm making this comparison, that I hope that people will understand that uh, bingo should not be the karaoke that we saw in Quebec City. Remember how many people got infected in Quebec City uh, with the karaoke? And I think that uh, if there is something that I'm asking those organizers, whatever they are, in the orange zone or in the red zone, and they could do it, and now they cannot do it, please use your judgment and make sure that we protect our people, especially those that uh, would be more affected. And we already, Dr. Arousseau has uh, commended uh, some uh, testing already in, uh, in Montérégie for that, in Saint-Jean-sur-Richelieu. Uh, hopefully, we'll be able to control that, uh, because so many people would have been in contact. We don't know that we'll let uh, Santé publique in uh, Montérégie make the necessary work, but hopefully that's not going to be as severe as what we saw in Quebec City.